Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we have a brand new perfume from Chopin, the beautiful jewellery company, and it is called Love Chopin, and it comes in this beautiful bottle. So I'm going to be giving you my review, let you know what it smells like, and tell you all about it. If you are new here, then hello and welcome. We are all about perfumes, so check out my hundreds and hundreds of other perfume videos. And if you're a regular but you haven't subscribed yet, then do hit that subscribe button and show your support. And as always, I will leave links to where you can buy this perfume down below in the description box. And links for where you can buy it in the UK, Europe and USA. So, I haven't done a video on Chopard fragrances before. I have um, some awareness of them, but when I saw that this one was a new release and I couldn't resist the bottle, um, I had to try it. It has this lovely, like, like a flower um, lid, really heavy, like thick lid, and then this really nice gold, kind of like a heart, but also a flower that says Love Chopin on it. And I just think that is a really nice bottle, like a really good idea. I'm impressed with the bottle and it feels like heavy and weighty and it feels fancy and expensive, just like their jewelry. I think the smell really reflects this deep red bottle. It's definitely quite a sensual nighttime smell. It is primarily a rosy smell, but this is not like a fresh rose. This is a deep Damascan rose. This has an oriental vibe to it, really oriental with a cinnamon in, honey, vanilla, patchouli, tonka bean. This is your um, sexy escape to the Middle East where your millionaire date whisks you off, buys you a million pound Chopin necklace and this is what you're wearing as you fly into Dubai. <laughs> like it's, it's very, it's got that incensey feel of a oriental perfume. It's really good for lasting really strong. I've been trying this today and it's really like filled my apartment with the smell, my clothes with the smell. It's a really good strong smell. If you like things like um, Dior Poison, uh, Chanel Coco, those heavier perfumes that have that big presence, then definitely try this. Even though it has so much rose in it, rose is, is the star of the show, but not in a way that I perfumes I tend to review are where it's like a fresh, freshly picked watery rose. This is a heavy, deep um, rose water, like the pure, pure extract of a rose. There's no freshness to this at all. There's a bit of cacao in here, a little bit of powdery violets, but overall it's this oriental heavy, heavy rose. I think it definitely is for someone who wants to make a statement with their perfume, something that really, really is strong and you can smell as you walk by, you can associate with that person. This could have very easily become a signature scent because you wouldn't be able to miss it. Everyone will be able to smell it on you. So I think it is a good quality perfume. It's good for lasting, good for projection, and the price is very reasonable as well. I think this was about 50 pounds and for the quality of the perfume you could easily charge 100 so I think it's very good value for money and the bottle alone is um, really worth it so I am super impressed with this perfume it's not to my personal taste I don't really like oriental perfume so I personally wouldn't be wearing this but I would definitely recommend it to someone who does like that type of perfume as a really good value for money buy. So guys let me know what you think of the Chopard fragrances. Do you have any of them? Which is your favourite? Which do you recommend I explore? Have you tried this new one? What do you think of it? Let me know down below in the comments. I do read all your comments. But that's it guys. So thanks so much for watching as always and I'll see you in the next video.